Every time I hear kickball, I think of that guy in Karate Kid 2 when they're singing the song at the end. I swear he says kickball. Hey, whack, who's this ugly new guy? I'm your worst nightmare. Okay, so you grab the balls and you uh, kick them into your goal. To kick, you press Z. Pretty much grabs the ball automatically, and once you have it, you can't really lose it, so. so grab the ball, kick it into your goal. That's all you gotta do. And you're really fast compared to them on this level, so. Oh, I kinda missed with that one. Yeah, we are way ahead. And, of course, in the semifinals, in the actual finals, there'll be a little more. Uh. It's, yeah, there'll be a little more of a twist to the game, like. I love how the music gets epic before the game's even finished. <laughs> Yeah, 18446. Nice. I think we won that one. Call it a hunt. You've won your quarterfinal. Move on to the semifinal. Don't you hear? Oh, why do I always do this? It must be winter or something. It's getting to me. It's the dark skies. Okay, so what's the advice now? Coming first again. Is that it? Yeah, I guess so. Red balls reduce your score by one. Try kicking them in your opponent's goals. Ooh, sounds sneaky. Yeah, that does sound sneaky. If you score the most, you'll probably win. Ho ho, you're so funny. <laughs> yeah, really. Hmm, so let's go play. Semifinals on the right, not in the middle. We're not going in order here. Ugh, my eyes. I have to keep ugh, rubbing them. My kickball. Those shorts look stupid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, they do. Whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, there's always going to be one that's, like, way ahead of the others, so just try to keep an eye on which one that is, so if you get a chance, or if you don't have any balls nearby, you can, like, you know, take the opportunity to kick a red one in. Yep, well, that's stupid. Yeah... Yeah, even, even to just kick one and get him behind by one, that can make the difference. And that's the same as basically getting a goal of your own, where that's one less goal you have to worry about getting, because if you tie, it actually uh, doesn't count, so you don't, you don't win. <laughs> that was close. No, that actually wasn't close at all. What the hell am I talking about? You've won your semi-final! The Mayan Kickball Final beckons! Oh no. It may be overkill cutting this trip out, but what the hell. Here's the advice for the finals. Kick the bombs at your opponents to stun them. Bombs? Now you're talking! No kidding. Has anyone mentioned that you should try to come in first? <sighs> Let's get out of here, Banjo! <laughs> I've forgotten what I was going to say. No wonder you don't play anymore. Aww. Uh, well, he's probably just old. Give him a break, Banjo. Give him a break. Okay, well, let's see how we do here. Man, my eyes are watering. The finals! You've no chance of becoming champion! Get out of here! You can't win! Andross's enemy is my enemy! Boom. Well, I stunned him. Shoot, I am not... Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, jeez, you guys. Crap. Look at this. They're not appearing. This is... There we go. There's one. Well, we actually scored. Yeah, it's nothing but red ones here. Here we go. Yeah. I think I've lost this one. Well, maybe not, maybe not, maybe not. Oh, I think we got it. Oh, man, that was close. Thought you had my ass that time. That was too close. I declare you the new Mayan kickball champion. I'm too choked up for words. <laughs> well, we got the jiggy. Let's get out of here. I think I'm going to head back to Mumbo's place now and... Uh, or, well, Wombos, I should say, to uh, transform back. 
If you ever need to transform again, which I get a feeling I will, but I'm not totally... Like, seriously, my memory is not that good right now. <laughs> I'm trying to think, but I've, when I start that recording, I get the LP curves where I suddenly can't remember anything. So, but thank God for those war points. You see, you can just get around really quickly in the world. And even in the bigger worlds, they're incredibly useful, so... This one, my magic, not need Globo next time. Bear change for free. Cool. Yeah, I bet that's not all you do for free. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. That was a little below the belt there. No pun intended there. Yeah, I'd like to see what's below your belt. No. Anyway. So, uh, let's go upstairs. And that little, uh, door that we kicked out as a statue. Let's go inside and have a look. I don't really think I can do anything in here. This is just like the Banjo Tui equivalent of the Sandcastle. So basically, uh, this is where you activate my cheats. Stand on this podium if you want to know how. Well, I don't really care how because I don't have any cheats right now, so I'm not going to mess with it. I'll show this later. I'm trying not to waste too much time here. So I'm going to try to get as much of this world done as I can. I really need to just go ahead and turn it off, though. Turn off the recording. Hey, wait a second. Dude, I should have gone in. Oh, I should have gone in there as a stony. Forgot about that. So anyway, you come up here and actually at the top. Um, when you, and this is something that I'm not sure I'm going to be able to do with this controller. I might have to get one of the older ones. But there's a snake sleeping here with a jiggy, and you have to sneak up on him. But like, I can't seem to. Like, I can only move the joy. All right, I can move the joystick. Like I'm pushing it halfway up right now, and it's not moving. And I just move it a tiny bit at a time. And eventually it'll start moving, but it doesn't start moving until it gets to a certain point. And then it... Whoa. Yeah, see, I mean, I'd, I was barely moving there. But it woke him up anyway, so... Uh, yeah, I might have to try that with the other controller, because I literally can't get it with this one. I tried for, like, 15 minutes yesterday, and I just couldn't do it. I didn't even think I was moving that much anyway, but oh well. Splendid. They seem to have gone. Yeah, but when you jump onto that platform, you have to jump onto the corner where it's just grass there, see? Otherwise, you're not gonna land anywhere. We seem to have a little thing here. Now, it might be hard to tell sometimes if you can grab onto a ledge, but if you see one of these things sticking out here, you know there's a ledge you can grab onto. Because these monsters will be on it. So. Uh, shoot. Dang it. Oh, I almost made it. <laughs> I don't think I can do what's up there anyway, because that's another area where you have to sneak up on somebody. <laughs> Got to that time, didn't I? Okay, it's a Cheeto page. All right, bring it on. So that's two of them. All right, well, I'm glad I did that, actually. <laughs> I thought that was going to take me somewhere else, and I was kind of worried about that, but... Nope, no need to worry. And this is the other side of that swamp. Can't really do anything there because you can't walk on this. But uh, just for shits and giggles, I'll show you what it looks like. Ugh. Weird looking monster. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, sure. Laugh it up. Laugh it up, fuzzball. You know what? I got healing right here. Yeah! Okay. Now, the later you get in this game, the better it gets. Like, seriously, I think the first couple of worlds are actually, like, the most boring part. But when you get to the third world, or when, it, when you really start to, like, do more stuff... Well, even in the second world, actually, it's pretty cool. Uh, I'm trying to think. Let me just think for a minute. So, now that we actually have that move that we learned from, uh, Jam Jars, we can go up here and get this now. Cool! Yes! One thing that's kind of cool about this game is you only have to collect two of those uh, honeycombs to get an extension to your life. But you won't be able to actually turn those in for the life extensions until uh, a short time from now. It's not very long. It's right outside the second world. So, easy schmeasy. Oh no. Ow! So, since we never checked out this... Uh... Wait... Excuse me. Uh, had a little hiccup there. Managed to hold most of it back. 
So we didn't check this out yet as Banjo Kazooie. Let's go do it. I also need to get that Jinjo right next to the move. Or did I pick that up? I think I might have picked that up. Prison compound. There's another warp point that we can get back here anytime we need to. Shoot! Oh man, I just remembered. I was supposed to. Okay, you're supposed to talk to this guy as a stony to get the code for the um thing, but I already know what it is, so I'm just gonna star sun star moon moon. There you go. So if you ever want to know what the code is, there you are. 